common problem people approach us about is cuts in leather. What I'm going to show you is how to actually repair a split. So the first thing you're going to need is a piece of vinyl or leather, a similar colour to what you're working with. I've cut a patch slightly bigger than what the split is. So to put the patch in, I'm going to feed it through the split and you need something flat and smooth. Make sure the patches lay completely flat inside, otherwise you'll end up with lumps in it. Using the regulator, smooth it out. Now if you need to move the patch around inside, if it's not gone in, just get a needle and literally stick it in your patch and that way you can actually drag and move your patch around underneath. Right, I'm going to glue the patch onto the split now. I'm using a special glue that I've made up, it's for leather, but you can use a contact adhesive, it works just as well. But don't use anything like super glues, they dry rock hard and what will happen is it will split your leather. The trick with this is not to try and glue both sides at the same time. Just glue one side, let it dry, then glue the other side. So the first side's dry now. I'm just applying glue to the second side and then pull the split together so both sides are as near as you can get them together. It's always a good idea. I have different weights that I actually use to hold it down and hold it together until the glue dries. All different glues have different drying times. You always read it on the tin, it'll tell you how long it takes to dry, but I wouldn't take the weight off any sooner than half an hour. So there you go, nice simple repair, something you can quite easily do at home, and it'll prolong the life of your favourite furniture.